For the majority of my work, I turn on the option of show all video frames to prioritize video playback so that I can see every single frame sequentially. Most of the time I prefer to set the timeline proxy resolution to full and use the cache for best playback performance and result. Set render cache to smart and let DaVinci Resolve process cache automatically. Fusion memory cache is also turned on all the time. If there is no cache indicator, convert to a compound clip and turn on render cache fusion output. In the project settings window, changing the render cache format to ProRes 4444 or GoPro Cineform can save a lot of storage space compared to the default DNxHR format. In the deliver page, enable the option of use render cached images, which will use the cache directly and save rendering time when we export the project. 